Hi guys, um, today is August 5, 2017. I was invited by a friend of mine. His name is uh, Sir Cloyd Velasco. He's the chairman of the Philippine Chamber of Commerce incorporated here in uh, Cagayan chapter. And he invited me to be interviewed in a uh, AM radio station, DZA, uh, DZCV, sorry. It's quite exciting because this will be the very first time that I have been invited to be interviewed or to speak in an AM radio station. So yeah, it's the first experience of mine. And uh, check it out, you know. Let's see what will happen and I hope everything will go well. And uh, to those who are listening, I hope that you will be, somehow, of course, you'll be blessed with what we are to share. Before anything else, of course, uh, today happens to be uh, the death anniversary of my father. Yep, there he is. And yeah, uh, miss him. He's my dad. And I think that phrase itself says a lot of things. He's my dad. Check out my experience with my interview in uh, DZCV. So, yeah. Isang magandang magandang umaga po ang aming ipinapaabot sa inyong lahat mga kaibigan. Araw po ngayon ng... Anong araw na ba ngayon doon? Sabado. Sabado. <laughs> araw Sabado. po ngayon ng Sabado. Sabado. Isang uh, masagana at uh, kumpleto ang bendisyon sa araw na ito. Dahil uh, Sabado na naman, araw po para sa ating pong mga pamilya. Asingko na po ng buwan ng Agosto. Muling sumasa inyo mga kaibigan ng ating pong palatuntunan, opinion, kagayaan, at of course, siyempre po naman ay laging uh, nasa uh, kaakibat po natin, kasabay po natin, partner po natin, ang Philippine Chamber of Commerce and Industry, Cagayan Chapter. At uh, siyempre sa pamagitan po ng ating uh, presidente ng PCCI at gano'n din ang chairman na narito po ngayon. At the end of course, naku, 
masayang masaya tayo dok <laughs> good morning dok good morning uh, partner uh, uh, dok uh, Sam and of course kay chairman partner Cloyd at kayo na po siguro ang mag introduce sa isang uh, uh, kapitapitagang uh, panauhin po natin sa araw na ito dok good morning it's a great great day which means it's a godly growth opportunity it is uh, a relevant platform because we have a very vast horizon and it is an energizer because we have updates and sharing today and it is an action-oriented program more than that it is a transformative initiative so good morning radio listeners good morning partners uh, may I now request our chairman to say his greetings and introduce our visitors chairman all right, so magandang umaga po sa ating mga listeners, no? Natutuwa po kami ngayon kasi may bisita po tayo, isang kaibigan, isang pastor, isang uh, entrepreneur na kung saan yung mga insight and wisdom niya dun sa area kung saan siya pumapayag pag ngayon ay may share niya sa atin ngayon in uh, uh, ang kanyang tika, profile. Tika muna, uh, Chairman. Kailan mm -hmm. ba? Nakikita ba ninyo at bumibili ba kayo? sa Bombay Bazaar. Ah, no. sa mga, lagi eh. Sa mga kaibigan ko talagang ano, nire-refer ko talaga itong uh, ano, itong tindahan ito kasi mm -hmm. alam at kilalang kilala pala, I should say, I changed my word, no. Kilalang kilala ito ng mga taga Cagayan. Yes. Even yung mga taga Isabela. So matindi oh, oh. talaga itong ating bisita Ang ngayon. Ang bigat kamo. <laughs> at oh. saka more <laughs> than that, in. more than that uh, partners. Mm. Ang father niya ay active member dati ng Philippine Chamber of Commerce and Industry oh, yes. and the records Nako. will speak. Oh, oh. Ah, okay. big, big hand. Okay. <laughs> so without uh, much further ado, I want to introduce to you Mr. Kumar Adani, a pastor and entrepreneur. Oh, wow. Okay, welcome, ito na po sila. Welcome. Good okay. morning po sa ating pong lahat at sa lahat po na nakikinig po today. Good morning po and God bless po sa inyong lahat. Ayan, napakinggan nila. Welcome. Ayan. Welcome ma'am. Good morning po. Good morning po. Hindi ko po alam na kasama pala ako. Akala ko taga video lang talaga ako. <laughs> Pero, anyway, good morning. Isang pagkakataon po. Maraming salamat sa pag-imbita. Uh, Pwede ako na, na, na ako na. <laughs> Excited na ako. Ma'am, sir, uh, ano ba ang sikreto po ng kayong mag-asawa po? Dahil sa mahabang-mahabang panahon, itong uh, New Bombay Bazaar ay nanatili na isa sa mga kapitapitagang uh, bazaar dito po sa Tugigraw City. Ayun po. So, uh, New Tugigraw Bombay Bazaar po kasi uh, was uh, naumpisan po yan po ng akin pong mga magulang. Si uh, my father po, the late uh, Gopi Adtani and my mother po, si Teresita Adtani po. Uh, they started this, uh, if I'm not mistaken, all the way 1979. Oh, na. Um, po. Uh, and... Uh, Ano lang po, it started na isang maliit lang po na tindahan sa palengke. Mm -hmm. po, eh, kung alam po ng mga tao po yung mercury drug po sa may palengke, yun po yung dating Bombay Bazaar po. Uh -huh. And of course, uh, it started with small small items lang po. Mga, mga watches lang po, mga lighter, ganun. And then, uh, um, of course, uh, isa sa mga talagang gusto namin pong ma-capture is yung tiwala po ng tao. Yung tiwala po ng tao sa amin, sa products namin, sa service po namin. And then, ayun po, uh, from there po, eh, by God's grace naman po talaga, eh, you know, it started to grow po. Imagine mo ha, Father Cloyd, 1979. Tagal ng panahon, ano? <laughs> oh. Oh, oh, wala pa ako dito sa tuging karaw. <laughs> <laughs> Nasa wala malayong pa. lugar pa oh, po oh. ngayon. Yes po. Okay, ngayon, ano, uh, sa akin naman, oh, kasi uh, nakita ko, na-witness ko yung pag-grow ng Carbarita, eh. uh, hmm. review center. No? Uh, alam po natin ito na review center para sa mga nagtitake ng let exam. No? At uh, nakita ko rin kung uh, paano hindi magkasya doon sa place nila. Ngayon ang gusto kong tatanungin na uh, uh, Sir Kumar, no? 
uh, gusto ko lang tanungin, ano ang uh, uh, mind mo or thought mo when you started this business? No? Para makita rin natin yung mga gustong magnegosyo ng ganitong klaseng negosyo, ay kailangan buwin na na nila sa kanilang mindset, itong uh, winner's mindset na to. Ito yung gusto kong itatanong kay Sir Kumar, no? So, dito po namin nakita yung potential ng market pong ito dito. Especially dito po sa Tugigraw. Eh, alam naman po natin, eh, ang Tugigraw naman po, eh, siya po ay isa sa mga, ah, actually, hindi sa isa. Siya po yung sentro dito sa Kagayan when it comes to education. Uh, yes. yes, yes uh -huh. po. So, and uh, nakita nga po namin na may demand po dito sa Tugigraw. And in Cagayan, pagdating po sa uh, a particular review center. And uh, ayun po, um, naka-witness naman po kami na, na meron po isang napaka-effective na franchise that was made available. Eh, nung nalaman po namin na available po siya, eh, tinake advantage na po namin. At dinala na po namin siya dito sa Tugigraw. Uh, uh, kami po mag as well as with our staff, We really had to come up with a very effective, appealing, and strong marketing strategy po. Tanawon natin mga mahal namin tagapakinig, no? Na yung reason kung bakit naging successful ngayon yung business na Sir Kumar at Mam Ana regarding dun sa Carl Barita Review Center. Medyo nahirapan ako bumikas noon. Isang sikreto noon ay ito yung marketing. Yung umikot talaga sila. Imagine they are hands-on sila na pumunta doon sa mga location na kung saan alam nila may market. Ang iniisip ko agad ngayon eh, ang focus kasi ng gobyerno, pati ang Philippine Chamber of Commerce and Industry, ay yung how we can enhance the micro-entrepreneurs to the growth environment. Paano mapalakas? Ganun. Sir, ito ang tanong ko naman ngayon. Yes po. Kasi ang daming nagiginig sa ating mga entrepreneurs, alam naman natin na bago tayo dumarating sa success, Yes. meron rin tayong mga pinagdala. So gusto kong, gusto kong malaman yung paano yung ano yung mga pinagdaanan ng, nung nagninegosyo kayo, especially nung nagsisimula kayo. Ilan yung employees nyo noon and ilan na ngayon yung mga employees? Ah, okay. Uh, well, just to give uh, ano rin po na quick background po about our life, nung nag-start po kami in the, the business world po, uh, yung mga unang business po namin ay sa Manila po namin na umpisahan. Oh, Doon kami, so, kami, kami dati kasi nag-work. And... Uh, To actually, I think the first two businesses na na start natin with flop eh. Oh, kagagawa. Narat na so din bilang ayon. Had to share. So prang yeah, we had. Hindi po hindi po magaday experience na yon. But emotionally, it was not a good experience. Dahil sa pre we felt sad. Ganon po medyo na lungkot po kami sa nangyare. But it was a learning experience po. You know, uh, meron po akong kaibigan, sabi nga po niya sa akin na even in negative experiences, you can learn a lot from it. Eh. You may learn what what to do, but you also can learn what not to do. Mm -hmm. uh, kami po namin mga nababasa mga successful stories and uh, lahat po ng mga successful people na to, eh hindi po uh, ano po, uh, hindi po bago sa kanila yung failure. Uh, from some point in their life po eh sila po ay nagfail. But the good thing is that they never stop. Yun. They kept on continuing and uh, still looking for better opportunities and mas naging wiser po sila ngayon kaysa dati kasi nga because of what happened or your experience. And I believe yun po yung nangyari po sa amin. We learned And not only from our experience po, but we kept on studying din. Nagbabasa po kami ng mga libro. Um, kinakausap po namin yung mga successful people. Kung paano sila naging successful. Um, andyan po ang internet. Grabe, grabe po. Ang dami pong resources sa internet. You know, and so we just learned as much as we could learn 
to make sure nga po na pagka nag-venture po ulit kami sa negosyo, ready ready po kami. Uh, sir, uh, ilang employees po nung nag-start po kayo ng business? Ay, nung nag-start po kami, kami lang po dalawa mag-asawa. <laughs> really? Yes, Your best, ano uh, talaga, parang uh -huh. business partner session, talaga. best partner oh. is your spouse. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Ayun nga po, actually the very first business na naging successful po kami was yung Changean po. Mm. Christmas Bazaar po sa oh, Las Piñas mm. eh, sa loob po ng isang subdivision BF Resort po uh, nag-rent po kami ng isang stall po doon hinati po namin sa dalawa uh, yung wife ko po kasi mas mahilig po siya sa ladies accessories so yung kalahati ladies accessories ako naman po since medyo mahilig po ako sa relo yung kalahati po panay bargain watch naman po ang binibenta ko Tapos ayun po, nagbebenta kami every day. Actually, pareho, pa pareho kami, po kami may work. May work kasi wow. I work at 7 to 4 kasi although hindi pa ako uh, talaga licensed teacher at that time, but mm -hmm. for some reasons private school do that. Day. Sorry po, private school, but I was uh, working from 7. Tapos lalabas ako ng 4. Uh, I would go straight home just to change and then around 5.30 pupunta na ako doon, no? Yeah, pupunta na po kami sa after po namin ng work, uwi kami freshen up, tapos diretso na po sa Changi and we would stay there hanggang 11 or 12 o'clock midnight. Depende sa araw. Basta ma-meet po namin yung kwota namin. Yes, <laughs> Kaya mo yung ginagawa nila is hard work, no? But one of the things din po that I've learned para po you know, kaya pong gawin yung mga lahat ng mga ibang mga kailangan na bagay po, you know, as uh, together as one, is uh, developing a very effective team. Mm. Yung may kasama, yung mga kasama niyo po sa, sa work. You know, to, to develop a very effective team para uh, ayun po, yung para maturuan mo sila and mat you could delegate the, the work to them. And basically, uh, ako po or my wife po, ang ginagawa po namin is we just monitor them po. But of course, syempre, there are there are still moments na hands-on pa rin kami. Uh, kasi ayaw namin po makompromise yung quality nung, nung performance ng business po namin. Yeah. Additional question, sir. Yes po. How do you find having a wife na Pilipina? Ay! <laughs> Other ba? Uh, <laughs> Ano na po yan? No question na po yan. <laughs> of course, uh, uh, sh uh, ako po, uh, uh, di ba sabi nga po ng Bible that uh, whoever uh, f finds a wife, uh, find uh, you know, it's a good thing, it's a blessing po talaga. And she is, she is a blessing po sa akin. Naku! Kaya partners eh, I would like to pick up from their messages eh, yung team. You don't know, Kaya partner honestly, and... itong binubuo natin sa PCCI, we're trying to form a strong team as uh, mm -hmm. partners. At uh, ito nga, parabang, ano eh, parabang, it's a rebuilding of the Philippine Chamber of Commerce and Industry. Mm -hmm. And I'm so engrossed and happy to say na from August to August, Chairman, kasama tayo mm -hmm. sa most likely na maging outstanding chamber wow. in the area. I did not expect that. But with the uh, with the trends, <laughs> uh, with the trends uh, going on now, well, with this radio program we are in and the people we're bringing in, nako parang ano ko eh. Uh, I'm so happy. Uh, it's providential. Kaya pag baba nila kanina, oh God sent visitors, <laughs> sabi ko eh. <laughs> Kaya thanks, uh, Chairman, and thanks, uh, visitors, our partners. I'm looking forward. Na while you have not unpacked what is the good news about coming in <laughs> as a team, no? Because I look forward that God has a blessed purpose for all of us. Because like what the, you're doing in your review center, I would like that we become a light also. Yes. To the future yes. entrepreneurs, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. the kiddy the junior under K-12 and the college student yes, so that we can really uh, know, firm up that Cagayan Valley is part of the growth area of Northern Luzon. If I may say po, uh, one last thing po, no? so sa lahat po nang nakikinig, uh, gusto ko lang pong malaman po ninyo that God loves you and because God loves you, eh, gusto, 
talagang nais o nasa puso po talaga ng ating pong Panginoon na kayo po ay maging successful at kayo po ay sumagana po sa buhay. Maraming salamat po sa paalala na yan, Pastor. Uh, Partner Cloy, please. Alright, so uh, to, all, to all our listeners, no, malamang sa inyo ho, may nabitin po. Oh, oh, uh, maybe we could oh, oh, invite uh, Pastor Kumar oh, once oh, uh, again. No? Oh, oh. Uh, di natin alam yun, uh, nasa kay Pastor uh, Sam na yun, kung uh, kailan ho, and uh, we'll just talk about it sa grupo. So, uh, to all our listeners, maraming salamat po, and uh, mabuhay po tayong lahat. Well, today is uh, a godly great day. So I declare that uh, without hearing their yes, they are now our potential and promising entrepreneurs, partners in the Philippine Chamber of Commerce and Industry, Kagayan Chapter. Uh, and we welcome them uh, with uh, joy and with all the blessings also. So, happy day, everyone. God bless. Okay, mga kaibigan, isang maraming maraming salamat po sa inyong pakikinig at sana po isang napakaganda at uh, ito po ay isang paalaala po ninyo na isinir ng ating pong uh, kapit-kapitag ang panauhin sa araw na ito na naglilingkod sa inyo ay uh, inaaabot po kayo sa pamagitan ng kanyang negosyo at ganun din sa paglilingkod sa ating pong, pong may kapal. Maraming salamat po kay Pastor Kumar Adtani at ang kanyang may bahay na si Ma'am Maria Ana Liz Adtani. Ang inyo pong lingkod, dahil ito'y apot ni Manang Yu, iti tangatang lida patong kadwa tayo, dahil ito'y engineer tayo nga ni engineer Ted Asuncion. Thank you very much. Good morning. Oh, thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. 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 Thank you